It's so great to see our friend Rachel Lambert. We're just singing here, losing our minds. Uh, she is with the Springfield Regional Arts Council. Rachel, always good to see you. How you, guys you been? too. Good. How have you guys been? Let me ask you one quick question. Absolutely. How busy are you? So busy. <laughs> oh my God, there's something going on like every weekend <laughs> from now until Christmas. It's insane. Mm -hmm. Um, but what I want to mention is First Friday Art Walk. Yay! Because guess what? It's October. Yeah. Woo! So we're in October. We've got 20 venues that are open. We have the free shuttle running again, which is such a big win for downtown to be able to have the shuttle running continuously from 5 to 9 p.m. Gets you to four stops, but they're all near all of the other venues that are open. Mm -hmm. So it's so helpful to be able to get that um, get that shuttle going yeah. to be able to get people around. Mm -hmm. it's so it's so uh, important to be able to get everybody around. Um, but we have at the Creamery, we have our um, special exhibit with Brewer Science. Mm -hmm. So they sponsor this exhibit every year and they um, it's a national juried show. So we have a national call out. We have hundreds of artists that uh, mm -hmm. submit their work for this, for this show and um, pieces are selected, and some of them come to our um, gallery to be shown in person, and then there's also an online viewing for, so you can see everything that was submitted from uh, across the country. Oh, wow. So some of these pieces came from as far as Pennsylvania um, to be shown in our gallery, which is really cool for us to be able to show stuff from here as well as outside of the area. Yeah. Um, and so the show is all about like nature inspired and uh, it's called Pure Enjoyment. And we have so many just really in interesting pieces on display mm -hmm. and we'll be open from five to seven like normal. We have food and drinks for everybody to come and uh, enjoy and then hop on the shuttle from the creamery to go see all of the other 20 exhibits that are open. Wow, yeah. that's so cool. Yeah. It feels like a big city. It does, it, it does. It does. It's, you know? it's incredible how something like that can make our small town feel so much bigger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but can, yeah. you go, can you go over, I'm sorry, I was yeah. sure you, there, you said there's four shuttles? There's one, one shuttle, shuttle, but it goes to four locations. Four stops. Okay, thank four you. stops, got yes. it. Okay. And those stops are marked, can they, people find out where the stops yeah, are? How does that work? It's all listed on our website, okay. but the stops are gonna be um, Brick City, um, the Corolla Art Center, the downtown church and the creamery art center. Okay. okay. So you can uh, hop, park at one of those locations, hop on the shuttle and make your way around downtown. And it's a continuous loop from five to 9 p.m. So you can just hop back on and go back to your car. Oh, that's that great. Wow. Really uh, makes it easy for everybody. Yeah, it really does. So the creamery is going to be the exhibit that's surrounded kind of by nature. Yes. Okay, now yeah. the other spots that you go to, that will just be whatever. It's, yeah, every venue is able to like kind of decide what they want to do. Sometimes we have featured artists at some of the venues. Um, you can see some of the pieces that are being shown. Um, these are at Ooh. various venues. Um, so, so th they're um, wow, gorgeous. Fe featured artists are a couple of these. They're all different venues, so I can't pick Pinpoint. out which ones. Yeah, right, yeah, for right. sure. No, 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 you're, no. Good. Um, you're good. But I can tell you that the uh, Park Central Library is going to have um, works by De Deborah McCamish. Mm -hmm. um, Carlsbad Designs, which is a new venue for us, uh, is going to have a... Um, like a fashion show, basically. Um, they're gonna have clothing from Carlsbad Designs. They're gonna have um, a charm bar where you can create a charm uh, jewelry. Okay. Um, right there on the spot with homemade or charms. So the charms are made, it's 207 trinkets, and so they're handmade charms that then they're having there for you to create your own piece. So Aww. it's two kinds of like handmade. It's really, yeah. really interesting the way they're doing that. Um, then the Galois is gonna be working with Mosaic Arts Collective to um, have a <laughs> Think Big uh, foot piano. Yes, the big, uh, from the movie Big. From the, the movie yes. Big, okay. Where Tom Hanks dances on the yes. piano. Yeah, yes. they're gonna have a big foot piano at the Galois 
from Mosaic, so you can uh, dance on the foot piano. So oh cute. Oh my gosh. Um, and then the um, Obelisk Home is going to have a um, a featured artist, Rebecca Lewis Smith, and so sh her work is going to be on display at Obelisk Home. Mm -hmm. So that's just you know a handful of the venues that are open this month, mm -hmm. but there's something at each of them that's so important to see and so exciting. Um, there's live music and you know you can see the new neon sculpture or mm -hmm. neon mural I can't wait that, to see that. Yeah. is so great. I cannot wait. It's so cool and you can download the app and like mm -hmm. update it on your yeah. phone. So cool. Um, <sighs> and uh, yeah so there, there's so many different things to see and so many exciting yeah. places to go. That's so amazing. You've always got great things happening. And it really, <laughs> I mean, First Friday Artwork holds a special place in my heart. It's so much yes. fun. So if people want more information on everything happening. Yeah, go to our website, springfieldarts.org. Oh my gosh. Well, thank you. So good to see you. You too. So great. So much fun. So yes. much fun to be had. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, don't go anywhere. Our local craft and cooking expert, Ingrid Fair, is here with an adorable fall craft right after this.